Well, in 24 hours, we'll be probably just through the first quarter, Mark Rosen. Let's go back out to Philadelphia yeah. and check in with Mark Rosen. It is our kicker story, so to speak, because the kicker could be big tomorrow, Mark. Uh, absolutely, Maxie. I'm standing on the steps that uh, Rocky made famous oh so many decades ago uh, when the last time the Vikings were in a Super Bowl, actually. Uh, the, the Eagles are using this underdog role to fuel them again. I mean, the only reason the Vikings are three-point favorites is simply because Carson Wentz, their outstanding quarterback, blew out his ACL in Week 14, and Nick Foles is now the starting quarterback for them. As we know, painfully so, the, there's a long history of playoff field goal attempts by the Minnesota Vikings. If it comes down to that tomorrow, it'll rest on the shoulders of Kai Forbath, who told our David McCoy that he'll be ready if necessary. It kind of got lost in the shuffle of the Minneapolis miracle that followed, but had the Saints not scored beforehand, we'd be talking about a Vikings kicker delivering a playoff game winner for once, which is why the fact that Kai Forbath nailed a 53-yarder with 92 seconds to go might be a bigger deal than you'd think. Yeah, it was definitely a big one because if we miss it, then, you know, the game's over, so. And the fact that if it comes to that again, he did just come through with a 49-53 and 53 yarder in just the previous playoff fourth quarter. Can only help, right? Yeah, I mean, you build on, on makes like that um, and just take the confidence over to the next kick, so. Forbath is fully aware of his predecessor's failures. He hears plenty from fans. Unfortunately, they still bring up the past. Um, you know, I wish they could move on from it. It's been years, so. Um, and didn't involve you? And didn't involve me, right. So, um, yeah, but there's also a lot of supportive ones and, um, you know, positive and just encouraging. So as a kicker, do you relish or dread the idea of it all coming down to you? I think if you dread it, then you're probably in the wrong profession. So um, that's kind of what you, you want is, um, and you, you know, we work hard and practice a lot, kick a lot of balls, so that, that case where it comes down to you is kind of what you've been doing all this work for. So um, you just kind of have to be confident and, and know that you can make it. That's what a fan likes to hear. David McCoy, WCCO for Sports. And in a game so evenly matched, it may very well come down to special teams. The Vikings had a kick block, a punt block last week as well, and Marcus Sherrills could play a very important role returning punts. So, Maxie, you know, anything can happen, as we saw last week. Special teams is something to keep an eye on late tomorrow afternoon. Back oh, to you. Oh, for sure. Thanks, Mark. See you back here at 10.